This video is sponsored by PlayStation. Thank you, Sony, for giving me a million dollars. I'm just kidding. This isn't a sponsored video. We are playing PS5. First time in my life I've ever owned or played a PlayStation, to be completely honest. If you guys watched the last video, we played the Matrix Awakens Unreal Engine 5 trailer. Mind-blowing, by the way. Go check that out. But today, we are playing Skater XL on console. Not just any console. Sk uh, uh... PlayStation 5, goddamn. While this boots up, we do still get to enjoy the console loading times, but uh, do me a huge favor, thumbs up this video. The button for that, every single thumbs up, greatly helps. And then I've been, I was actually did my first PS5 Skater XL gameplay on stream today. So if you're interested in being a part of that next time, link in the description for my Twitch streams. I go live pretty much every day, give or take, but uh, I would love to see you there and hang out and talk. I think this probably goes without saying, but because we're on console, there are no mods. So jumping on in, there's no sound. Jumping on into it, we have the Mega Moon Gravity. All of my other console Skater XL videos were filmed on... <laughs> Great start. All of my other console Skater XL videos were filmed on an Xbox One. So this is a huge upgrade, but like realistically from your guys' end, you're not gonna see much of a difference. Yeah, I kind of just wanted to see how it plays and uh, skate. I guess that is the point of this. I have the default clothes on. Let's go, oops. I shouldn't need to high pop because everything is high pop. Front tail. Oh God. The vanilla sounds. Maybe we go faster. I missed. Dude, okay. I have a question for you guys. This has been happening nonstop. It was happening all day today while we were streaming. I go to do an ollie and I'm not scooping, at least to my knowledge, I'm not scooping, but my boy, I do like this weird no foot ollie glitch, I guess. And it was driving me absolutely crazy because I, I swear I'm not doing that. If anyone knows how to fix that, like it, it happens sometimes, let me know. But I just want to get this uh, front tail 270. Damn it. <laughs> oh, the top comment. I'm not used to doing these. The top comment from the last YouTube video. Well, this isn't exactly a, a top comment recommendation, but this has the most thumbs up. It says, if I remember right, this is the map you first learned how to play manual catch on in a video back in the day. So this is my last Skater XL video. <laughs> Let's do that as the top comment. Damn, this was a year ago. And this was my first time ever playing Skater XL with manual catch. That's a trip. If you guys are OGs of the channel, uh, this will probably bring back some nostalgia for you. I'm bringing back the background videos where whatever the top comment is, it's to choose what goes on the TV in the back. Angle it towards you guys a little bit more. The good old days. I just want to get a couple clips from this map and then kind of explore, I don't know, to just be a, be a console player. Explore some of the console maps, the console mod IO clothes, all that stuff. I'm dead. I think some of the, one of the hardest things for me to get used to, because the, the, the physics aren't that bad for me to get used to. What it is, is the the, the turn on wind up, because you can turn that off with mods. So now I'm not like, when I'm trying my full cap, ooh, that was sick. Ooh, that didn't even look vanilla. That looked pretty damn good. Throw a flip in there. No, see. The pre-wind got me. I guess it's all about timing. Ooh, almost. Oh, I thought that was it. There it is. There it's not. I said not. There it is. Uh, rebate. I want to get a good one, and I want to go back to fakey, I think. I think that'll look better. Dude, I'm flipping those crazy. That flipped so crazy. I'm content with that, that was cool. I got brutally corrected in my video on this map by saying Jean Olive as the map creator. I was told that his name is French, so it's Jean. Jean Olive. Oh my God, I got impaled. Please forgive me if I'm saying that wrong. I have a very American accent. So I just did a video on this map. I would say, I guess now, probably about a week ago. A lot of you seem to really, really, really like the map. And then of course, there's a lot of you that say it does not, oh my God. A lot of you say it doesn't skate good on console and then it sort of caters to PC, like modded physics. Obviously I, I love modded physics. I'm not, not denying that at all. But I think this map skates fine with, with Vanizza. Van Van Vanizophilics. You know, I mean, you just low pop. Oh, 
forgot about that. I don't have straight pop out on default, so I gotta tap the triggers that wanna pop out straight, so... God, this is hard. We'll do front blunt, straight pop out. I don't have time for it. There it is. Not. Trophy earned, grind to grind, sick. You know what, let's just spice it up. Let's go to manual. I'm bad. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna take that, honestly. Good old kinky. Let's hammer out some tricks here. Start with just a mega gap back lip. Maybe clean it up a little bit. Oh, that was like a hurricane or whatever that's called. Dude, that was so cool, but I was not trying that. There it is. That's my best one yet. Maybe kick flip in. Yeah, it's definitely, you know, it's, it's not PC content, gameplay, whatever. It just kind of like, it just hits different. Not in a good way, not in a bad way. It just hits different. That's gonna be the title of this YouTube video. Skater XL on PS5 hits different. That's good. Kick flip back over crook. Oh, almost. I think that was it, yeah. Look at that lighting and the reflection on the puddle there. That looks pretty good. You just don't get that that pinch, but I'll take it. I also found out there was a night version of this map also on console that I actually didn't know about, which is really cool. It would be nice if you could adjust the time of day like you can in session, but I'll survive. What else do we got here? I don't want to spend too much time here because I just made a video on this. You, that crook sound. <laughs> Better. That was a cool line. Nolly heel flip, no slide. No, I don't want to pop out. I forget that you can still bump out. There, and then back three, nose grab! Boof! What am I doing? This is an experience that I don't often get to experience because because I play PC. I still think it's borderline absurd how you can't search the mod browser yet. Primitive park. I have to be able to just to sort by maps. There we go. So we have industrial zone. I'm looking at this like expecting a new map. I'm pretty sure we're limited to what we've had, which are, I mean, they're all great maps. I, I definitely think that Fermenter Plaza, you know, what? I want to play Fermenter actually. I can pretty confidently say that in my opinion, Fermenter Plaza and uh, um, the new industrial zone map are probably my two favorite um, maps that have been added to console. No offense to the other maps at all. Like they're, they're all amazing maps, but I think, you know, with the, the infrequency that console players get new maps, these are probably two of the biggest and, and most appealing maps, I would say. I forgot about this map's sick. I, I haven't scared this map in a minute. Oh, and we have the DIY map editor in vanilla now. I, this is new since I last played console. Can we do this? Can we clear this? Push faster! I pop! There's no chance. And I got the, the no foot glitch. Now there's... N uh, it's close. Is there like a bigger... Bigger ramp I could use? I could use... I could use that. We can cheat. I bet I can clear it now. Oh, I, that was even, that was less close, God. All right, enough tomfoolery. Okay, wait, one more tomfoolery. Big spin front board. That just wasn't a board slide. Big spin front board. Still wasn't a board slide. Big spin front board, there it is. Oh, I did a bigger spin. God, all right. It's hard, man. Obviously, like, I'm not, I'm not very good at the game to begin with. But console skater XL, at least going from PC skater XL, is a very different experience. It, it, it hits different. Tray flip over crook. I guess that was a tray flip nose grind. One more. There it is. Bump out. A little hard flip. And a big old nolly heel flip. Let's just keep this line going until we fall. Okay, that was quick. How does this work for gear? I really, I, I, I'm i new to all of this. I don't think I've ever used the mod browser for, for clothes. I like these decks though. So we're gonna download these. Um, Mahogany Denim Wolf Gang. All right, those are cool. Let's get these. What else do we got? I wish you could sort by like pants or, oh, chains, yup. So now how does this work? Just. 
as uh, as you'd expect, I'm assuming. So it, it really is the same as, as PC, just more limited, huh? That's a really cool deck. Okay, let's go with that. Um, I'm usually a black pants type of guy. Those brown ones aren't bad. Royal, is that red? No, that's blue. I almost kind of like the, the faded cream, though. That's what she said. Oh, yo, we got the J's, boy. Okay, let's go with that, but then we need darker. We need darker pants, something like that. Give me the fro back. Sheesh, look at us go. Oh, we big balling now. World's highest front side flip, switch heel back. Oh, almost switch heel back lip. This is fun, man. And I, I know all the console players are gonna be commenting like, yeah, it's fun for the first day. I get it, I do. However, I'm having fun. One thing that's gonna take me forever to get used to is the lack of decoupled board rotation. On PC, if I wanted to do a big flip, I would do a tray flip and a 180. But on console, because it's not decoupled, you do a bigger flip. So I would have to do a varial flip 180 like that. So if I want to do a, a big flip back tail. No, see? It's going to take some getting used to. There it is. This is cool. I, I it, It's very odd to me because my audience goes two ways. There's those of you that think I'm a... Easy Day Studios dick writer that I, I praise everything I do and I, I cherish them. And there's those of you that think I bash on Easy Day Studios too hard, which is funny how it's either one or the other. I've always said that Console Skater XL is a great game. I've also always said that Skater XL on PC is better. So much of it is just is little stuff. Because I know that Skater XL said they're they're probably not gonna add a stats menu because it doesn't match their vision for the game. But then why not be able to add stuff like simple dude that glitch. Simple things like like board customization just being able to ride an 8.5 an 8.25 an 8 a 7.75 a 7.5 like simple things like that being able to search the the mod browser little things wheel size you know what i mean stuff that uh session does offer it just seems like you know if, if for whatever reason they don't want to add a stats menu they could be doing other little things that that's like my my number one complaint. Let's take full advantage of our vanilla physics though. We can probably finally skate this pyramid. Oh, we <laughs> we skated to flat. Low pop. Yeah, lo low pop, low pop clears it perfectly. I wanna do a little, woo, I'm still manual catching. Cause you can still do like front foot catch. Yeah, if you just manually catch it on console. Big old ghetto bird. And then whenever I do that version of a ghetto bird, I always gotta pay tribute, pay homage, and do it. Oh, do a real one. There it is. What else we got? I try to avoid. Whoops. I try to avoid Smiths and Feebles at all costs Ow. in uh in vanilla gameplay, just because it doesn't get the same dip that I'm used to. Like, bad example. That wasn't bad, honestly. A lot of the time, I. Yeah, I mean, those actually look fine. Maybe it's front feebles I have issues with. Like, it's not necessarily the game. That looked good, too. It's not necessarily the, the game that has the issues. It's me not being used to them. That is that, that throws me off, you know? Grant Park is low-key an underrated map in Skater XL. I feel like no no one really skates this map. It's a really fun and flowy map. Hard flip map. Not what I was trying. Oh, God. No, I earned a trophy for being a Mongo pusher. Wow. I was going for a hard flip back lip. There it is. I got hard flip back nose on accident. Let's keep this line going. Nolly heel board slide. Isn't there a glitch where you can get out of the park? How do you do that glitch again? It's like... I don't know. How do people do that? I, I know you can do it. I just... I'm going the wrong way. How do you do it? Someone, someone told me once and I forgot. Oh, we're getting closer. We're getting closer. <gasps> We've escaped. Yes. I'm free. Wow. This is my first time doing this. Oh, this is probably such an old glitch. Oh, we can skate them. Look at this. Ain't nobody out here getting clips on these stairs. These are the out-of-bounds stairs. These are where the, the cool kids skate. I clipped it. I'm gonna clear that little uh, 
crack. Boom. Damn, glitches are fun. I missed like trying to do skate three glitches ever since skater, ever since PC gaming. I never, I haven't been into glitches since then, but this is kind of cool. Where else can we go? There's no chance these are splined, right? No, okay. That, that would have confused me. How far does this go? This could be B-roll for a uh, Skater X. Oh, I broke it. I didn't know games could crash on console. I thought it was a PC thing. That's what I get for talking about glitches. Good old downtown Los Angeles. You know what is the, the biggest difference I can feel uh, from Xbox One to PS5 is the smoothness of, of the game for sure. It, without a doubt, like, like minus the, the physics, obviously, it feels like I'm playing on PC. A hundred percent. Stop the cap. Playing on Xbox, you'd have some framing it, or at least for me, I've, I just got an old, an old shitty hand-me-down Xbox, obviously, but it, it, it plays really, really, really smoothly. Um, it's just the the, the dead giveaway is the physics. I like it, man. It's uh, it's 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 refreshing. It's pick up and play, and struggle. You know, no dealing with with mod sliders. No trying to figure out if you have the right version of something. It's a very simple pick up and play type thing. And it's really cool because I can play with you guys too, who are also on PlayStation. We did a multiplayer lobby today on stream. Watch this. I'm gonna outro the entire video in one line. I'm gonna get all the talking parts done. So if you guys could do me a huge favor and thumbs up the video, I know I say it in pretty much just about every single video I film here, but the support lately has been crazy. The channel has been growing insanely fast. We actually just hit 110,000 subscribers, which is a pretty mind blowing number. Ooh, that's a sick gap. So do me a favor, thumbs up the video, subscribe if you're not yet, turn on that bell. Let me know, I have a PS5 now. So let me know what, uh, what games you want to see me try? What games you want to see me play? That being said, I didn't think this line would last this long, so I think we officially knocked everything out. I will see you guys in two days for the next video. Peace out.